What's well, freaking up, guys? It's been a while. Uh, I'm back. Basketball season just ended. I this is the first day I have off, and it's freezing out. I don't have anything to hunt. Uh, not much to do, honestly. But I'm just like kind of doing a little vlog thing. I got my little target right here. I got a new bow for Christmas. Uh, I want to kind of get into that and. Yeah, we're just gonna shoot this. We're gonna shoot my pellet gun. Just do some stuff. I don't even know. Um, and yeah, I'll just talk to you guys. I freaking miss doing this. I haven't posted in forever. I apologize for that. Here's the wind. I don't know if you can even hear me, but it's about 35 degrees out right now. It's pretty cold. But we got the uh, pellet gun and the bow right here. I got a bear and then got my little gamma right here so not too sure what we'll be doing today stay tuned guys just chilling day in the life of dom day in the life of outsider here enjoy the video guys i'll see you soon so i uh i just got this bear um i've got it sighted in at about maybe 10 yards but uh I got this, one of my buddies gave me this, True Fire Grip uh, release for the bow. I'm just getting into this, by the way. I'm not. I'm nowhere near good, but this is my bear. It's a Vast RTH. Um, I got Decimator Arrows. Uh, if you guys know anything about this stuff, I'd love to talk about it. I love talking to you guys about this stuff. Um, I don't know if you guys follow me on Instagram, at Outsider with three R's and three underscores. I post a lot of stuff about my bow. Uh, I've kind of just been shooting it every once in a while, and yeah, I actually really like it. Um, I can't wait to hunt with it next year, so let's see. I might even sight this in today. I might try to at least, but yeah. So we're going to go get it all measured out. I'm going to go get my uh, Allen wrenches, and let's see what we can do. Alright, so we got our grouping here. Uh, it's actually pretty tight. I was not expecting this at all, but yeah. So it's basically sighted in at 10 yards, which also wor will probably work for 20. So I'm probably going to shoot like maybe another shot at 10, and then I'm going to go back to 20 and see what I can do. Um, I never really thought of it, but it's probably, probably the reason that. I can't hit it 20, it's just me. It's not that the bow's off, because a bunch of my buddies helped me sight it in here. So we're gonna go to 20, shoot exactly how we did at 10, um, real smoothly, uh, repeating myself every time, like like a good bow person would, a good archer would, but we're gonna do that, see what we can do. Um, hopefully get it sighted in at 20. Well, not sighted in, but hopefully be able to hit it 20 just gonna come with practice so let's see shoot I forgot my bow number one guys If I can hit from here, I'll actually be really impressed with myself.
That grouping was not good. I'm just going to tell you guys that right now. Actually, it wasn't that bad. There's just one that's way off. Let's go freaking get them. So guys, uh, this year, I'm probably just gonna, I'm, I'm trying to grind out content. Like, I wanna hit, I wanna get big this year. Not big, but I wanna get going. Um, I wanna just freaking, I wanna put out as much content as I can. I'm gonna get my license this year, so I'll be able to fish a lot more. I wanna like, I, I'm, I'm gonna catch PBs this year, I'm gonna do it all. So, you guys, keep staying tuned. This year is going to be the best year of my YouTube, no doubt. It just keeps getting better. Keep sticking with me. It's going to get better. But um, I really want to uh, I really want to catch a big flathead this year. I want to go down the river a lot and fish. I want to catch a PB bass. I want to catch a big bass in Kentucky. I, never, I don't think I've ever caught a bass over like four pounds here where I live, which is, there's no excuse for it, but. I've only been fishing the freaking ponds there in my neighborhood for the past three years because, I don't know, there, there isn't many lakes near me that is like within like 30 minutes or an hour. My family here doesn't fish, so it's just hard getting out there. But when I get my car, I've already been mapping out spots. I'm extremely hyped about this summer. Uh, you guys leave in the comments what you guys want to see because really we can do it all now. Um, survival Walmart challenges whatever you guys want to see we'll do it um, and yeah so let's go check these uh, arrows I want to show you guys that um, yeah I'm super pumped about this summer so stick with me guys and you guys got video ideas drop them I'd love to hear them so um, as the uh, as the freaking as I shot at it, it tilted more to the right, it tilted more this way. So that's why these are like that. But that's actually a pretty good grouping at 20 yards. I did not expect that really. Um, this one's a little bit of an outlier, but I'm pretty sure that may have been the last one I shot. And I was just like, I was ready to go check. But these three, they aren't that bad. Um, I'm actually getting a lot better at shooting. I was really smooth with that one. Uh, and my release and everything's getting smoother and smoother so that's actually pretty cool I didn't even think I was sighted in at all on this last time I shot I'm pretty sure I did not hit consistently at all like at all um, but yeah so that's all I'm gonna do for today I didn't even really get I didn't even really sight in my bow but I don't really need to because it kind of already is, but like I said, this video is kind of just a, I'm coming back, I don't have anything else to post, and just get back with you guys and give you guys something to watch, so hopefully you guys are enjoying this, I don't know if you are or not, I don't, I kind of like doing it, I kind of don't, I don't know, new stuff kind of scared me, so just let me know what you think about it down in the comments, I can start doing these every day, honestly, if you want me to. Round two. That one may have been a good hit. I don't know. We're hitting close to a bullseye. Not very consistent because the wind and stuff and I'm just going fast. But this is pretty good, guys. I'm shooting a lot better than I was a freaking month ago. Let's go check those. This is kind of a weird video, but I'm still going to post it because I haven't posted it in forever. But I hope you guys enjoy it. Uh, you know, maybe you do enjoy this. 
I don't know if you would do or not, but I actually downloaded Fish Brain the other day, and because I've been, you know, it just helps with spots and stuff. I've uh, been looking around, and there's some decent fish being caught around me. Uh, I really want to get out soon, but it's just 35 degrees out right now, and I have no motivation to do that, especially on like a school night whenever I don't have time. But uh, as soon as it gets warm, I think Sunday is going to be like 60, so I'm going to try and get out then. That would be super, super good if I could. Uh, I don't know if I'll catch anything, but I'm going to try. Uh, I'll go either for bass or cats, but here's my little group in here. Uh, as you can tell, the thing's still tilted a little bit, but these three down here, I mean, that's completely on horizontally. This one's a little outlier, but I'm shooting pretty decent right now, honestly. Well, this is a freaking problem. I literally just tightened this back on and it's already, pff, I sat it down and it fell off. Literally my bow was finally sighted in. What the heck? Gotta go tighten this up real quick. So I got the Bear Vast RTH. Um, I got a Field and Stream. It was, it was for a Black Friday deal and let me tell you it was a good deal, but I'm pretty sure I got this like half off, but I just wanted to get into bow hunting. Um, I always thought it was cool. I thought it was more of like, more of, um, how do you say it? Like, shoot, more uh, natural. There's a word for it. I don't know what it is, but anyway, I just, I always really liked bow hunting. I, I like the thought of it. There's like more skill that's involved to it. That's why I use a pellet gun. Or I try, or yeah, that's why I liked using a pellet gun last year for squirrels that entire time because there's so much more skill for it than there was in just using a shotgun and blasting them out of a tree. But yeah, there's more skill with this. I think it's more, um, the, the words just at the tip of my tongue. I just felt it coming out and I, it didn't come out. But anyway, here's the bow. Um, it's the Bear Vest RTH. I really like it. I really enjoy it. Um, yeah, it's not bad. I've never had another bow though, so I don't really know. But um, uh, my my friends did say there's like there's not a lot of release on it, but that's okay. Uh, it gets the job done, I think, in my opinion. Um, and there's one more thing I, I want to show you guys before I end this video. It's a short one, I know, but it just which is kind of giving back to you guys. The the real content will be will start coming in soon. Um, it's getting there. Spring. We're going. We're on spring break. I'm going for bull reds. I'm going for a bunch of big fish on spring break on the beach. So that should be cool. Um, this year, I I really I just want to I want to grow. I want to grow a lot. Um, my Instagram has been growing a lot recently. I just figured that out. I figured out like the algorithm and everything. I started growing that better. Um, YouTube, I'm just going to post at least weekly, if not two or three times a week. I, I really want to try to post a video every day. With transportation now, I feel like that might be possible. Um, I'm really going to grind this summer. Monetization doesn't mean much to me, but it does mean like a lot of people will ask you, uh, are you monetized? you make money off YouTube and it's kind of just like a sign of success people are like oh he's like legit you know and you know that makes me that makes me feel good but uh, yeah so this year hopefully we hit like you know I I very minimum I want to hit at least a thousand more subs to get to 2,000 but I really want to make more than that um, I'll take as much as I can get I want to get a lot of watch time I want to I want to post a video that goes viral this year. I definitely want to do that. I don't know what it's going to be, but I really want to do that. Um, everyone wants to do that though, but I just want to grow this year. I want to grow with you all, and I just want to keep going, building the thing.
Also, I want to, uh, I want to, I want to make merch this year, 100%. I want to make merch, but before I do that, I have to get some money, so I'm going to work a little bit this summer, get the money for it, and make merch for y'all, so there's one more thing I want to show you guys in this video. I'll be right back. I'm going to go grab it. Okay, guys, so I've been hyping up about this. Um, so Whisk Whisker Seeger Tackle back in November did a deal on, um, it was these FMJ rods, I believe, and it was, you, you get them for like half off, and I bought three of them, okay? I took my Catfish Commando reels off of my Catfish Commando rods because my rods are like, the eyelets and stuff are broke off of those and stuff. And these are just, these are a lot uh, longer. I got the seven foot six ones, and they're a lot heavier. So I've got this eight ounce weight on here. Um, mind, I fish Mississippi River a lot uh, with my uncle and my family up in Illinois. And this thing handles it so well. I also got this reel. It's an Abby Garcia catfish special. It's probably the nicest catfish I think I've ever owned. Um, and all in all, this entire rig is just completely insane. I cannot wait to get on the river, to get on anywhere and fish with this. And I'm going to cast it here. Literally, just when this thing casts, it's just like, oh my god. So, I'll listen to this, guys. Does that not sound cool or what? Uh-oh. Oh wait, we're good. I thought I cast over a tree. But, um, I cannot wait to fish for some big flatheads, big blues, big channel cats, anything, honestly, with this rod right here. Um, whenever I get a car, I'm just, or whenever I get my full license, it's just over. I got until May to get my entire license, and I just cannot wait, so. You guys are going to see these rods used a lot in this summer's videos. Uh, I'm just going to do it all. I'm going for it all. We are going to fish a ton this summer. Um, right now, every time I see an Instagram post of people fishing or whatever, I'm just like, wow, I wish I was in warm weather. I wish I could go fishing right now. I'm so hyped for whenever the weather gets warm and stuff. But... Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, this video was kind of just all over the place. Um, I got bored, and I'm sure you guys have been waiting for a video. So I just wanted to catch you guys up on what's the plan and stuff. So uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you so much for watching. I know it was a weird video, but I'm trying to post as much as I can. I'll probably have another video out soon. Uh, the weather's supposed to warm up here soon, but it just depends if I catch anything or whatever I'm doing. Uh, also, maybe I'll do a shed hunting video. I don't know. I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Peace.